Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm sharing with you everything I bought while I was on vacation in Scottsdale. Some vintage designer items that I'm so excited about um, and some fun jeans, some denim, and a couple of other things that I think you'll really like. A lot of these items are based around me trying to find game day outfits for my husband's hockey games. And our colors are navy, gold slash yellow, um, and white. So a lot of these things you'll see a reoccurring theme. I'm trying to add more navy into my wardrobe. So I've got a couple of things that are really awesome for the games. Let's start out with the Sephora because I know that's probably why most of you are here. And I have a lot of it on my face that I'm going to be sharing in a tutorial um, trying new makeup at Sephora. I will share that with you in a video um, coming up really soon. I just filmed it. So let's go through my bag of goodies. I have had this on my want and wish list for so long. Um, this is the Boy Smells five piece discovery set. And you get obviously five of them. You get Marble Fruit, Hinoki Phantom, um, Cashmere Kush, Flor de la, Flor de la Vir Virgin, and Woodphoria. So I'm going to be trying these out and I will let you know what I think about them. If you just want to see what they look like, that is what they look like. I am weirdly, I love minis and I'm weirdly obsessed with little discovery sets like this. I've had the Mason Louise Marie. I've had that one. Um, and I've had some others from Creed that I really, really like. So I think these are the best value. It was like 25 bucks and you get to try all these different scents. So I really love that. And it was the last one in store and it's usually out of stock, but they just restocked it on the Sephora website. So I will leave it down pinned in the comments for you guys so you can shop all these different items. Um, and then also in the description box. Okay, one of the reasons I went in Sephora is for what I'm wearing on my face now. This is the new Hourglass Veil Hydrating Skin Tint, and I got the shade 10. I was so excited to get this. I will leave my major thoughts and like application and everything in that next video that's coming up, so be sure you hit subscribe so you don't miss out on that. But I, so far, I really like this. It comes in, I think, 16 different shades um, and is very hydrating especially if you have dry skin this is great for um, just quick easy no makeup makeup days so we went to visit our friends in Scottsdale they own a solar company out there they're just doing wonderful things for the Scottsdale community um, and they just bought a new home so we went to the Morgan Wallen concert I'm sure if you watched my other video you've already heard if you follow me on Instagram you already saw but um, my friend Morgan and I, we were all going to dinner and we stopped in the Sephora. I forget the area it was in, but it was so beautiful. They had a Love Shack Fancy. They had all sorts of different wonderful, incredible shops. And I saw this blush that just absolutely, I was like sucked in and I had to have it. So this is the new blush from Give. It's the Feeling Cheeky Amplifying Blush Duo. When I tell you that I could have bought every single one of these because the shades were so beautiful and there's a shade for everyone, um, this is the Lasting Love and I love the packaging, but look how pretty those shades are. It's what I'm wearing today. It's so gorgeous and this is something that I think you really need. I don't, I don't care which color you get. If you like coral shades like I do, this one is, <laughs> look how fun. The packaging is it's like a little bandana if you like coral shades this is a good one they have a more um, cool tone pink just really beautiful shades you got to try this it's so good originally why I even had to go in Sephora I had to replace my merit this is the merit volumizing pomade in the shade brown it's what I have on my brows today I love this it's incredible I talk about it all the time um, I've tried some other ones and this is just my favorite shade and it just does something really magical to the brows um, fills them in without filling them in and I just love that so it doesn't like get everywhere it's not goopy it's just a really really nice product and I love that it is clean at Sephora um, okay the next thing that I picked up are three glosses so this is what the packaging looks like 
Um, I got three different shades of these Anastasia glosses. This is the shade Guava and then Cantaloupe and Amber Sparkles. You guys, when I saw these in store it was like a moth to a flame i had to have these i had to have all of them i couldn't say no no part of me was gonna say no i had to have these so the color that i'm wearing today is guava and then i have amber sparkles on top so i will swatch these for you so you can see the different shades next to each other. I will say guava has the most color payoff more than cantaloupe because cantaloupe is a little bit more sheer and these are the shades right here so you have guava cantaloupe and then amber sparkles and that is them right there and then you can see on they're very comfortable very nice very pretty I love the formula um, they're just gorgeous. So I love the packaging too. It's just very like pretty girly. I don't know. Just makes me happy. You guys know I'm looking for navy and ballerina flats are all the rage. It is like probably the most popular shoe that you're going to see this fall. Let me tell you the story about why I was even shopping in the first place. So I was looking for a navy uh, bag. So like a handbag. Maybe I was looking at Chanel, I looked at Gucci. I looked at Prada, I looked at every single store looking for a navy bag and they just didn't have anything anywhere. They didn't have any navy sneakers, they didn't have any navy shoes anywhere. Navy was just not in the cards for me at any of Saks, uh, Bloomingdale's, Nordstrom. I went to Neiman's, I went to every single store. You guys know if you've been to Scottsdale, the shopping is it's on another level. They have anything and everything you could ever want. Anyway, so I didn't find any Navy anywhere. So I went to a resale shop that does like high end designers called My Sister's Closet. And if you are in Scottsdale or anywhere near the Phoenix area, you have to go to this store because I'm telling you, it's the best. The best store. I love outlet shopping. I love finding designer items for a good deal, on sale, resale, all sorts of things. I check the Real Real and Fashion File like probably daily. Um, so let me show you what I got a lot of stuff, but let me show you what pair of flats that I found in some random section someone had sat down. These are the Bottega Ballerina flats. I could not believe that these were there in navy. Can you believe they had these in navy in my size? So um, these were, I don't even know what these are originally. They're made in Italy um, and they were 145. Can you believe that price? So I'm just gonna wipe them down, um, give them a good condition with some leather conditioner. And I mean, they are in almost perfect condition and how cute are they gonna be with jeans and like a little navy blazer they had so they had a whole section of chanel tweed jackets they had chanel jewelry they had ysl they had every designer you could ever imagine golden goose all of it so um they had lots of jeans is my main point and i have obviously like i said in my update video i've gained some weight so obviously need you know bigger size jeans so I am in what seems to be a 27 that's about what I run in most like Zara things like that um, so these frame jeans are so cute so pretty they're like a washed black denim and they were $49.95 and they are the Le Skinny de Jean Jean j-e-a-n-n-e -N -N -E. so if these are still available i will link them down below but can you believe they are so stretchy so pretty i tried on probably 20 pair of jeans and they had mousy um they had just all different kinds of jeans that you wouldn't even believe the price burberry louis vuitton um all the designers like every big designer they had all their clothing 
it's just a matter of finding it in your size. So I got these frame jeans, which I love. And then I also got these. So these are a kind of washed tan pair, which I thought would look so cute with the shoes I'm about to show you. But these are the Legeants, I think is how you say it. Um, size 26 and these were $39.95. I cannot believe, cannot believe uh, the price on these and there's absolutely nothing wrong with them. They are so beautiful. They're just a like normal kind of more skinny jean and they are, they're perfect. So I got a pair of those for such a good deal and I loved the color on these and I loved how comfortable these are. So um, I'm excited to have those. These are really special because obviously we live in a big, we live in Virginia Beach so it's a big Navy town, military town. Um, there's just like all kinds of bases here. I mean it's just like military everywhere and we are the Norfolk Admirals. That's my husband's hockey team. Um, so these were really special when I found them and the fact that they were in my size, I felt like it was just meant to be and they're going to look so good on game day, um, with my varsity jacket that I got and either one of these pairs of shoes. So these are Ralph Lauren and they are <laughs> patchwork and they are so cute, but they have all of the, um, little like dive master, open water instructor, naval training base, fight deck. I mean, how cute. The little anchor, we have an anchor for our, um, like our logo. I mean, I just couldn't believe that these were in my size. So these were more expensive because they were Ralph Lauren. These are $69.95. I couldn't believe it. Like, I just, I'm so in love with these jeans. They are so special. I will never get rid of these. Just for the mere fact um, that they are just like, they were made for me and, you know, for me to wear to games. So, I love these and I'm so excited that like the varsity trend is back. So, this is going to look so good with that varsity jacket that I got that is navy and yellow. And, not to mention... The stitching is navy and white, so it goes perfectly with our colors. Okay, so that is everything that I picked up jean-wise, clothing-wise, at the resale shop. I'm going to save the shoes for last because they are just so good. It's like, oh my gosh, I just can't. So I went into Saks, like I told you guys, and they were having a huge sale up there. So it was like 75% off of already clearanced items. You're not going to believe the deal I got on these jeans. I feel like my whole trip was just, sh I was actually shopping for like a handbag, shoes, and I, well I did get some shoes, didn't find a single handbag. I got a lot of jeans. I found these Veronica Beard, which I love, um, jeans, and they're size 27, which doesn't matter what size they are, no. Uh, but these are the Carly Kick Flare Color is D-R-N-G-O, and I got these for 75% off of $139. So they were originally $278. Can you believe that? These are the cutest. I love that they don't have any, um, like, distressing. They're just a really nice, make your butt look so good. Uh, and they have the little kick flare on the bottom. I will insert a picture right here of me wearing them. I put these on and I was like, uh, sold. Done. Put them in the bag. <laughs> I need those jeans. And they had a few sizes left online. So I will link them down below in the comments for you guys and the description box um, so that you can try to find these in your size too. And then the next pair that I got are equally as fabulous. These are a more flare than the ones I got at Nordstrom from AG. These, these are the current Elliott. I got a size 25 in these. So these must run, I don't know, bigger. Um, these were originally, oh gosh, there's so many stickers on here. Originally, these were 188 and I got them, I think 94 was the price. Um, it says 94, but I think that was like the final price that they had on these. And I love these jeans. They look so good on. I love the color of these. 
and I love the pockets on these. They really lift your behind um, and they're just fabulous. Here is the flare. So it's a little bit, it's a little bit bigger of a flare, uh, but just looks very, very classy and elegant um, while still feeling like you're like on trend. I will link these if I can down below for you guys because these are so soft and just like the Veronica beard, they're soft, comfortable denim um, with a little bit of stretch, but it's still going to hold their shape. So I really love these. They had a lot of good stuff at the sack sale. Um, so I'm going to leave the link to the sale below. Hopefully it's still going on. If it's not, check out their sales when they do it. I think they do it a couple times a year. Um, they're 75% off of their clearance items. You will find the best deals on designer items and really nice jeans, shoes, their bags. They had Stella McCartney, um, Bottega, all sorts of bags, 75% off of already marked down items that were like going for nothing. There were, there were so many he was showing me, but just didn't catch my eye. Um, I didn't really, you know, want to invest some money in those, but these jeans I'm excited about. Okay. And then I thought I would show you a couple of items I picked up. I had a revolve credit. Um, and I picked up these two items for game days. So I got this Bobby Los Angeles in a small, this top, and I thought it was so pretty. I love the neckline and it had this kind of like poofed out sleeve with this long cuff. Hopefully you can see that, but I picked that up. It's just like a base layer for jeans you know, black pants, leggings, whatever. And then I also saw these, these were both on their sale page. So these are the same brand as the other ones, the Legeants, I think is how you say it. Um, a really nice brand that I love. Like I absolutely love this brand. These are so soft. They are a navy coated denim and I got a size, it's a skinny jean. And I got a size 27. So these are the Marguerite High Rise Skinny um, 30 inch inseam. And like I said, 27 was the size that I got and they fit perfectly. So I love these. You can see they have just a little bit of that shine. They're very comfortable. Just the perfect amount of stretch um, to really lift your behind. And then I also ordered while I was on that trip this really cute East Coast sweatshirt. I saw, I think a girl on either Pinterest or TikTok, she had this sweatshirt and I forget where it was from, but it was sold out. So I ordered this off Etsy and I'm not super impressed with the quality of the actual sweatshirt itself, but I think when, once I wash it um, and dry it, it will feel good. It's the Gildan brand but I got a size medium in this. So I love having that. I love being on the East Coast. It's just like, it's so fun. I love being an East Coast girl. Okay, now what we have all been waiting for, the shoes of the century. I am so incredibly obsessed with these. I had no idea when I walked in, they were gonna have a whole section of Chanel. I could not believe that when I looked down and saw these navy and white, ballerina flats I was like are you are you kidding me like I was like you know sound the siren sound the horn I couldn't believe it so I was like okay these are not gonna be my size flip it over and it's a these were a and these were a 38 and a half and I thought oh my gosh it's gonna be too big because I'm usually a 38 um, typically a size 8 or 38 and I was like, okay, I'm just gonna try them on and they fit and I could not believe it. So my first pair of Chanel ballerina flats, the bottoms are kind of worn. They were 245 and I think these usually run, these are vintage, um, both of the shoes are, but I'm just in like this like vintage era, I guess you, if you will. Uh, but I was so excited to find these ballerina flats because I was looking for very specific things when I went and it had to be fit all this criteria for me to spend the money and like be under a certain price and the certain colors and obviously fit right and all the sorts of things. So these are perfect. I did see these on the real reel. Um, 
I think black and white so I will leave those listed uh, down below for you guys if any of you are interested in a pair of vintage Chanel flats um, vintage is in right now and it's having a moment and I've always I had a vintage shop when I was um, I was living in Franklin in my townhouse and I had a vintage like resale antique shop and um, if any of you guys in Nashville are familiar with gas lamp antiques I had a booth there so uh, my Paul was into it it's just a whole thing anyway let's not get too into that because I'll start getting emotional if I start talking about Paul but um, I'm so excited to have these and wear these two games and I think that is everything that I picked up while I was in Scottsdale I hope you guys enjoy this video don't forget I will be sharing what I got at Zara because I did I think two other two trips to Zara and I got some really cute things and I also got some things um, delivered since I have been gone so uh, I have a lot of Zara I'm like I need some water I'm losing my voice I have gotten a lot from Zara that I cannot wait to share with you good fall items good items for now so I have to get that film today um, to get it up for you guys so I'm so excited lots of fun videos coming so be sure you subscribe don't forget to hit that thumbs up button if you liked this video follow me on Instagram at Ariel Carr and I'll see you in my next video bye